It, it, it's, oh, man, you, you guys got to forgive me. It's like, hey, what's going on, uh, Virgin Gang? So what, what were we today? Snowshoe Virgin Gang. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing pretty good. Sorry, the topic of the day, it's uh, it's up here, and it's a stew, and it's a pretty funny one. Before I get into it, though, just want to say thank you to Shiny Vert. He actually sent me a bunch of Pokemon card sleeves. I do collect those. He sent me some from like some of the older ETBs that I did get, but I opened them up in sleeve cards that I put in my binder. So I have the sleeves, but they're not like an actual sleeve thing that I can collect. So I appreciate the hell out of that, man. He didn't want a shout out, but I mean, he sent me some nice stuff. He's over there on YouTube. Go check him out if you want to. I appreciate it so much, man. Thanks. So let's get into let's let's get into the topic today. Jesus Christ. So Reddit, right? You can look at that stuff revolving about anything in like the card, the grading, the Pokemon TCG, Yu-Gi-Oh! TC, any fucking sports hobby, right? You can look at it, and there is a plethora of entertainment that just floats around there. I saw something on there today. That made me laugh very, very hard. And then someone sent it to me as well. And I laughed very, very hard again. It was just, it, it was a good old time for me looking at Reddit. So it's just funny who this involves because of what they do. Previous things I've discussed. It, it's CGC. Of course it is, right? It's just a very funny, goofy thing. It's, it's, it's not really like as bad as like it could have been. It's just fucking hilarious to me. All right, so we got here on Reddit, right? It's a birthday card from company that laid me off. What the fuck? So some quick context. I was a grade finalizer at CGC for their upcoming toys division. I uprooted my life to move cross country for this job. Okay, so it sounds like you went all in on that job. CGC was doing some good stuff for you. They were trying to get you fucking paid, and you went ahead and took advantage of that. But about three weeks ago, I was let go. <laughs> It's not funny. It's really not. I, I, I'm sorry. My birthday is in a couple days, and after checking my mail today, I got a birthday card from their HR department. I'm not sure if this was intentional, but this was so callous and cruel. So he got laid off by CGC, right? They was part of the toy division. You guys have already read all that stuff, right? The, I guess the HR department didn't actually check who was still working with that stuff or like someone in CGC's line or someone who's supposed to be forwarding that stuff to people didn't take this dude off the actual birthday card list or something because companies like that, they don't actually like know you personally or know your birthday unless you like rub elbows with them you go fucking play tennis or golf with them on the on your downtime or something that, that's really the only way they're gonna know you right so they didn't take him off that list he got laid off and fucking while he's still trying to look for work or maybe already has work but i'm sure the the saltiness of going there uplifting your whole life and giving a little bit to cgc for them to lay you off i guarantee that stings right well add a little bit of alcohol to that known as a birthday card from their hr department what's goofy about it too is it's directly from them he has another picture of it and it's it's dead ass like signed by them and there's people in the comment section are like oh this was intentionally done or something like that so I, i'm gonna play a little bit of devil's advocate real quick this is still fucking awful by the way this is goofy and if well, somewhere i worked did this there would be a video of me shooting this with a fucking shotgun and sending it to them be like that's what i think about your birthday card after laying me off so what happens is, is probably for whatever month of birthdays it is, or maybe they do it for two months at a time, they're going to get a bunch of cards, right? You know, get a dollar fucking birthday cards. They're going to put a stack of them on the table where all the big dogs work, all the fucking CEOs and managers and all that stuff work, right? They're all going to go through and sign them. They're going to sign all fucking 50 of them right there and then, and then they're going to distribute them out because it's easier than finding people individually to sign a bunch of cards. When they're doing a meeting, they're going to take 10 minutes and sign them all, right? That's what happened. It still got enveloped and it still got sent to said dude. But like that, it's just funny because it's CGC, and as you can see, they all signed it right there. That's pretty. Uh, that's pretty good. Celebrate your special day. It's funny because CGC is a grading company that's supposed to go through multiple checks, multiple lanes, multiple things to actually go through and check things accurately, and then send things out accurately as well. So like, uh, it's just <laughs> the whole thing is funny. And CGC for some reason just can't catch a fucking break with anything. Like it just always seems like you fire something up. And CGC is doing something else. I hate being that guy. I'm giving PSA the rocks. Don't worry, I'm going to give other grading companies the rocks too. It's just, come on, man. You got to admit that's funny. You got to admit it's funny that CGC, you know, the accuracy grading extraordinaires can't check their database to make sure that someone they laid off is not in their system anymore. going to get a birthday card fucking three weeks after they had some fucking salt thrown in their wounds for being laid off from CGC. It's funny, okay? It's it, it's not funny for the person. I'm very sorry you got laid off, and I really hope you're finding additional work. That It's just, it couldn't be more poetic that CGC is the ones that did that. I don't care what people have to say about it. I don't care what the fanboys got to say. CGC, cool, great with them, do what you want. PSA's not really doing much better right this second, and who knows what the hell Beckett's up to. Just, it's, come on, come on. 
That's goofy. If you got that at your work, if you'd got something like that from your boss that laid you off, you, you'd be the exact same way. You would be like, well, fucking CGC made a bunch of, It's just a mistake. But dude, that's fucking salt right there. That's something that actually hurts for when you're getting laid off work. And for someone who works in like a corporate like thing like that, where people actually send out little birthday cards and things like that, there's, there's way worse times that could happen too. Like fucking someone is dead or, you know, someone is like critically ill or things like that, and they're just sending you out like a birthday card like that when you don't work it there anymore. It, there's so many things that could happen where it's just it's like, man, CGC, maybe maybe get someone to check that database real quick for the people you're letting go. Maybe do some of that accuracy you put on those cards and maybe put that somewhere else. Hey, that's that's just me. Otherwise, this post wouldn't have existed. I wouldn't have got a good laugh for the last like 10 minutes, dude. That's hilarious. Fuck it. See y'all later.